Here it is, the Pick Ninja Revenant 2.0 series pickleball paddle, a paddle not far off from its original release. The Revenant still combines the same T700 carbon fiber face, 16 millimeter core, and the five and a half long inch handle. A paddle that combines power, strength, cleanliness, and its look at a fraction of the cost. Now let's get more into detail with this thing. My first reactions with this paddle is realizing how balanced this paddle was. Um, my habit is always playing with weights on my older paddles, whether it's on the top corner, or the top of the head, the throat, but this one right off the bat, I didn't need that at all. Like I said, I weighted a lot of my paddles down, so it took me a little while to get used to not having weights on this particular paddle. But once I dialed that in, it was really all smooth sailing from there. And then one thing I considered a cheat code of mine is that me personally, I suck in the wind, playing in the wind and all that stuff. But switching from my primary paddle at the time to this one, um, I felt like it was a huge change while playing in the wind. Um, since it didn't feel like my original heavier paddle, this is a lighter one for me. So I felt while playing against the wind, I could swing as hard as I want with a lighter paddle and still get that amount of top spin, if not more, because I feel like this face is a bit more grittier and that ball would just sail and die down into the court. Another thing about this paddle, I feel like it's well-rounded regardless if you're an aggressive player or a defensive player. For me, I tend to lead more on the defensive side because I love frustrating people when they just overheads, overheads, and just getting it back. Um, this paddle definitely has the touch. I'm gonna throw in some video here of like doing drills with um, my good friend, Mike. Uh, this is a close friend of mine that really just hits hard. If that ball is up there, he's pounding it down um but started doing drills with this paddle like the resets and the touch were just all there you let the paddle do the work just make sure you're there and just you know like all you have the only thing i had to adjust personally was like the grip and then other than that the paddle just did everything else from there in terms of drives the carbon fiber face is super gritty where you can get a whole lot of top spin on there and the ball would just die down a fun fact that I want to share with you folks is that I had the opportunity to meet the owner of Pig Ninja Sports. His name is Fouye. This dude is the um, total embodiment of, I guess, not to be cliche, of like the Aloha spirit. Knowing that this guy owns, started, and manufactures everything for Pig Ninja Sports, he is all about getting people together, uh, spreading the the love of pickleball. Like he goes to like all these different venues in in the place that he lives he was always a phone call or a text away um, just to see if he had anything going on and this dude did not hesitate and he's always going to do anything to help you out whether uh, you're getting into pickleball or trying to push your uh, career as a pickleball player but all in all this guy is an awesome dude so Fouye, i want to dedicate this video to you you guys, if you really want to try out this paddle, you can use my discount code ZAC10 on the website using the links below. You will not regret it. So let's get out there and play. Let's go pick Ninja.